Welcome back. Hey everybody, so it's Sparrow, welcome back to my channel. So, you guys have been asking for a skincare video. I think it's time for that skincare video. I'm sorry it took so long to do. I have to make sure my routine, I love it. I had to make sure that it was, it was perfect and it actually did what I needed it to do. I think we're ready. So my skincare routine is about my skin. Your skin may be different. Everything in my routine is based on a certain condition about my face and that's why I use it. So that's what we should, we're gonna try to focus on today and you're welcome, people asking for my skincare routine. You're welcome. All right, first thing, so the first thing I have to show you is gonna be the Biosense Squalene, 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 and Antioxidant Cleansing Oil. So stop, hold the presses, I used to hate cleansing oil. Well, the point of cleansing oil is to kind of introduce oil to your face and tell the oily parts of your face, hey, there's enough oil here, you're good chill your face produces excess oil so in, in terms of my face i'm oily skin my nose and t-zone because i'm combo skin this area produces excess oil because it thinks my face is dehydrated i don't have enough moisture on my face to keep it okay so it produces oil to make it work so i'm only going to take one pump of it that's all you really need and i'm going to smooth it into my hands and then apply it to my face this is also one of those no drip oil. So don't feel bad about getting it on your eye area because it's not going to drip, leak, or otherwise run into your eyes. And yes, I now look like a horror movie. Thumbnail. <laughs> it breaks up your makeup, but also you're gonna be working on making sure that you're getting your face hydrated and ready for anything else you decide to do with it. Now, you can decide to do a lot of things with your face, but it's very gentle on the skin and I don't mind it. The second thing that we have to do now is sing the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air theme song. In West Philadelphia, born and raised, on the playground is where I spend most of my days. Chilling out, maxing, relaxing, all cool, and then shooting some b-ball outside of the school. When a couple of guys, up to no good, started making trouble in my neighborhood. I got one little fight, my mom got scared and said, you move with your auntie and uncle to Bel Air. I whistled for a cab and when it came near, the license, say, the license plate said fresh and it had dice in there. I pulled up to the house about seven or eight and I yelled to the cab, you home, smell you later. Look at my kingdom, I was finally there. So I have the oil, I'm massaging it in for a full minute which is about how long it takes to sing the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air theme song. So after you use your cleansing oil, the second important part when you're rinsing it off is called milk phase. The milk phase is when you add a little bit of water to the cleansing oil so that it creates this like white foam, looks kind of like milk, and you massage the milk phase in. The milk phase is what really makes that cleansing oil activate and really get all that stuff off of your skin. I don't know if you guys know this, but I love Korean dramas. I know uh, the drama love knows that. We're watching. We were watching Uncontrollably Fond together, and that was ridiculously good. But I also have really got into Korean skincare techniques and skincare in general. But the Korean skincare technique of double cleansing, I always thought was silly. One cleanser does the whole job. With oil cleansing, I can now do double cleansing with my second cleanser and my original cleanser that I was using before I added in the oil cleanser, which is from Glow Recipe. And this is the Blueberry Bounce Gentle Cleanser. So this can be used as a cleanser or a mask. Um, I would prefer it as a cleanser. As a mask, it kind of, I kind of just got weird. It's kind of a weird texture for a mask. So it's just a regular gel cleanser and it's the second step cleansing. Step one is to remove everything and get, keep the skin hydrated and give it like a hydrated, supple layer. We're now gonna use the Blueberry Bounce Cleanser as a gel to finish removing any leftover dirt and debris from the skin. Be right back. All right, after cleansing, go ahead and apply a lip balm. I just keep whatever current free sample lip balm I have in my skincare basket just so that 
this one nearby. It's easier. It's just easier to have it on hand. This one is by Carrie Bom de Rose. It's fine. It's like a kind of wax. It's kind of waxing. It smells like roses, and I hate roses. All right, so now we can get on to masks. Everyone loves skincare masks. Skincare masks are like one of the top products people want in their skincare basket. I need a mask that does this, I need a mask that does that. I love masks. So, I have two, and also, and then exfoliation. And the terms of clean skincare would be mask and exfoliation. And since your mask is supposed to put something in your skin, your exfoliation takes stuff on off. So I have a mask and an exfoliant, my, and I have to alternate. So my exfoliant is the go-to exfoliating, there we go. These are the go-to exfoliating swipeys. I like these for working on my nose. My nose gets very clogged up with blackheads very easily. All you have to do is take a swipey, swipe the face, leave on for 60 seconds, and rinse it off. The mask is also for biasin, so it is the it is the biosense squalene and glycolic renewal facial. Um, I can only use the biosense once a week. This is a very intense renewing facial. You can leave it on for 3 to 10 minutes and it will refresh the whole face or you can just use it on certain areas that you need a new set of skin on. The swipe ease is only for 60 seconds and it's a little glycolic pad. So we're going to use this one today. I can use this one every other day and this one once a week. So you take your little swipey pad and take it on your nose. Really quick, want to show you that the swipe bees kind of have like these little crystals in it. It's a very gentle exfoliating crystal inside on the actual swipe bee. So again, taking it over wherever you need exfoliation, which I take it all over, and you're gonna leave it on for 60 seconds so you can massage it in with the swipe bee or you can just leave it alone. I like to take it all over the face because the whole face can be equally exfoliated regardless. So the glycolic renewal facial from Biosense while we're waiting for the swipe bee to cure. If you don't know what glycolic acid is, really quick, glycolic acid is an AHA, which basically means that it is a surface exfoliant for the skin. It is a chemical exfoliant. BHA you know better because it's salicylic acid, which is in most acne medicines. I use a ton of glycolic acid because I am allergic to salicylic acid. I cannot use it. It is bad for my skin. I get welts. I break out. Anything that I usually use that has salicylic acid, I'm finding that now that I've completely removed it from my routine in my life, my skin is so much happier and breaks out so much less. All right, I'm going to go wash off this swipey. Okay, so now that I've wiped off the swipey, you can see my skin has a newfound glow of radiance. It is not tight or dry, but rather soft and supple because of the oil cleanser. And now we're going to brighten because as an African American, you do end up with a little bit of the darkness in places. We're not going to be using any lemon. We're using the Caudalie Vino Perfect Concentrated Essence. This is all I have left. That's how much I like this. So for essence, I thought, oh, you get a little contact. No, 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 no. Will you get G about your skincare? You're gonna use your hands. Put three of these in my palm, pat it in between my hands, and pat it into my face with my fingers. So, essence, yes. But, gotta go. Second essence. This is the Laneige Water Bank. One pump of this bad boy all over the face. And I don't apply it. You think, apply, oh, no, 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 no like drip it on your face. No, stop it. YouTube, Instagram, everybody ruined it for everybody. This one is a hydrating essence. So its job is to hydrate the skin. Its main goal is to stay on the nose and hydrate the nose so it doesn't think, oh, well, she washed all my oil away. Better oil up myself. So we use that. So two essences, two cleansers. I'm starting to sound like Thomas Halbert. I'm sorry. I forgot to do eye cream. You're supposed to technically do your eye cream before your essences, but as long as you put that shit on, it don't matter. This is the Tatcha Luminous Deep Hydration Firming Eye Serum. I'm sorry about the price tag. You're gonna kill me, but it works. It feels really nice on the under eye. You don't need a lot. I think I've had this since, huh, 
I want to say I've had this at least six months and I've been fine, no problems, no worries. Um, and I just put it on my under eye and my like outer corners. It makes my eye area feel so hydrated and it look so much better once I started using it. Like right now, I just need to go to sleep. It's like one in the morning. But after that, I'm gonna be beautiful. I'm going to be gorgeous. Now that we've done all of our essences, we can move into serums. Now, this serum, I only use when I feel like, you know, right after I've had a couple breakouts, I'll use this one. It's called the, it's more caudally. It's the Caudalie Vino Perfect Serum. This is a sample. You don't need much, but I use it about once a week or so just because, just to keep up the brightening effect. I put like three, three, three drops in my hand. And again, the same thing, massage into hands and pat onto face. This gives you thin, even layers of a product without accidentally over applying. Because over application seemed to be my issue with my skincare I found, is that I was like always thinking, wow, my skin's so sticky. Because I was putting so much extra unnecessary product on that my skin felt sticky. And I just feel like at this point, once you figure that out, you're gonna have a really great time. Oh, tea. So next is gonna be another serum. This is a, a Yell & Co. Sunflower Sweets Serum. You may have seen this serum on other channels like Jackie Ina's. This is, they're now called a Yell & Co. Not Bahi, but this is their Sunflower Sweet Serum. It is by far the most natural thing I'll ever probably put on my face. And it is amazing. I use three drops. This gives you a very oily, glowy sheen. I kind of like to avoid the nose until I'm done patting it everywhere else on the skin. And this will fight any kind of breakout. So whenever I have breakouts, like during my period or anything, this definitely is like that step that really makes sure that the breakouts are very minimal. And I get very little. And it leaves your skin looking really, really glowy and almost oily. If you overapply, if you overapply, you will be oily. So, just a few drops, spread them out in your hands. So, now we're at the end where now it's moisturizer time. This is my day moisturizer, but sometimes I put it on at night. This is a glow recipe watermelon pink juice moisturizer. It has, and I just do, okay, one pump of that. On the palm. I did two now because the spout decided to be weird. And this is just your light moisturizer. I use it mostly in the day and it has a little bit of glycolic acid to really promote a glow on the skin. It smells like actual like watermelon juice. Like and I don't know if you've ever bought watermelon juice like from the store. It smells so good. So good. So good. Now when I want that really heavy boost of hydration at night or if I feel like in the morning I'm gonna wake up and feel like trash and not really feel and gonna be dehydrated. Because some mornings you know you some nights you know when you go to bed, I'm gonna be This is the watermelon glow sleeping mask from Glow Recipe. This is my night mask. Its job is to let me goddamn live. One glop is more than enough. Take it, spread it out on your face, on your hands. And spread an even layer on the face. It's gonna seal all your skincare in to leave you able. I don't know if you're a stomach sleeper like I am, but if you're a stomach sleeper, yeah, or a side, or even a good stomach side sleeper, you're mushing your face into the pillow. All your delicious skincare nutrients go into the pillow. You didn't pay for that. <laughs> So I use a mask to hold everything in and it's going to keep me hydrated overnight. So my skin is going to feel soft and moist, well not moist, it's going to feel soft and hydrated in the morning. But anyway, yes, that is my skincare routine. What do you think? Too extra? Too much? I wasn't going to change it anyway. The point is, take care of your skin, target your main skin concerns. But anyway, that is it. If you like this video, you should give it a thumbs up. Thank you for your time, for your requests. I appreciate it. My camera is gonna is overheating, so it's time to go. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like anti-hauls, first impressions, 
reviews, tutorials, go ahead and subscribe. Share this video with a friend who has oily or combination skin. I'll be here for you. I'm here for you. And let me know anything you want to see down in the comments below. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.